Shalom, blessings to you. Welcome, sheep in the garden. It's your faithful black sheep, Mama Bear, Miriam, Rachel. I'm here to talk to you today about everything I've learned in Scripture, and you and I have studied it together. And we have searched through the Dead Sea Scrolls and the Apocrypha and, and Revelation and Micah and the Old Testament and Psalms. And there's no evidence in Scripture whatsoever of a sun simulator. And let's face it, let's be realistic. We know if we are, uh, you know, conspiracy minded at all, which most of us are, that they want us dead. The elites want us dead. And if they could control the sun, if they could turn it off, they would, <laughs> right? They would turn it off and just let us die. And we would die very quickly without the sun. And they know this. They're not controlling the sun. If they could, they would do what they want to do. They would have us all dead and then they would have the world to themselves. They could turn the sun back over once we're all dead in a couple of weeks, months, whatever it takes. They could come out of their bunkers, turn the sun back on, and everything would be fine again. They would have the world to themselves. The fact of the matter is they can't control the sun. There is no sun simulator. That's all part of the deception. Got to peel back the layers of deception. See the big, big, big picture. They don't know what's happening. They know something's coming. They don't know when. They're guessing. They want it to end quickly. That's why they've got their underground bunkers, someplace to run in case the sun does go out. Nowhere in scripture does it talk about a sun simulator. Nowhere. God bless you and keep you and open your eyes to the whole truth and nothing but the truth in Jesus' name. Jesus is coming. That's the truth. You know who's in charge of the sun? Jesus. God. God is in control. That's all I found in scripture. God is in control. God is in control. God is in control. Jesus is coming. That's the whole truth. That's the whole story. Prepare your hearts, repent, repent, turn to Jesus, give your whole heart to him, your whole life to him. Come out of Babylon, stop paying attention to this world and what it wants you to believe and see the truth. Get into scripture. It's not going to lie to you. We're living the end. This is an exciting time to be alive. So exciting, terrifying, humbling, exciting. I can't believe Jesus woke me up to, to witness all of this. This is amazing. This is wonderful. God bless you. Get into scripture. That's where the truth is. And the scripture says there is no sun simulator. Jesus is coming. That's what scripture says. Jesus is coming. God bless you. Amen.